quality snowball for unbelievable Tucker Snowcats, most recent toys of the super rich. Here's a fun sounding vehicle ideal for the chili and snow that is as of now grasping quite a bit of North America. Tucker actually no, not that Tucker simply denoted its 75th commemoration making the snowcat, it's orange painted, four tread snow vehicles that have roused backwoods skiers, authorities, and progressively, the super rich. Bloomberg in a current story composes that interest for the Medford, Oregon Construct Organization's items is taking off in light of interest from the well-off, who require an approach to get to their backwoods mountain with draws. They're additionally sought after from authorities and gearheads who likewise cherish snow, similar to two mysterious gatherers who are accepted to have amassed more than 200 vintage snowcats. The estimation of vintage models has apparently tripled in the previous five years to well-finished $100,000 for a completely re-established fix. Tucker Snowcat Corp cases to be the world's most established surviving snow vehicle producer, propelled by E.M. Tucker in 1942 out of a want to outline a vehicle for going over the sort of profound, delicate snow found in the Rogue River Valley of his youth. It was four Tucker Snowcat machines that helped English voyager Vivian Fuchs and his 12-man party make the initial 2,158-mile overland intersection of Antarctica in 1957-58. While a large number of the organization's rivals either covered or adjusted to serving ski resorts with more extensive, heavier treads, Tucker has adhered to its recipe of influencing lightweight vehicles to head out finished profound to snow. Many Tuckers utilize Chrysler's level 6 chamber motor, or its Dodge Hemi V8 for bigger snow cats, mounted back or midway, with fundamental, no-nonsense aluminum lodges. Snow cats all have four articulating tracks that are freely sprung, fueled, and turned at the drive hub. Track choices come in three unique composes, traditional steel grouse or belt track, elastic covered aluminum grouse or belt track, and one piece all elastic track. Directing is using pressurized water controlled by turning the front and back axles for cover development up undulating territory with insignificant unsettling influence of the ground cover. The organization today influences 75 to 100 to snow cats a year for clients including the US military, oil penetrating groups in icy spots like Alaska and North Dakota, and utilities. However, request is high to the point that it's propelled a productive administration exchanging and repairing old machines. E.M. Tucker's grandson, Jeff McNeil, now leader of this division, scours Google Earth for surrendered snowcats rusting in lawns that he may have the capacity to procure and repair. The organization has even wandered into horticulture, figuring its lightweight vehicles are a decent match for ranchers who require delicate gear to take a shot at delicate ground, for example, rice paddies. The section level 2, 